Hi, you guys. This is a message for my Scorpio babies. How you guys doing, Scorpio? It's a Saturday afternoon. I know I'm running late, but I did not forget my babies, my Scorpion kings, okay, and my Scorpion queen. Cannot forget you guys, period. <laughs> period, period, period. I'm going to do something different, though. I'm going to pull a hit message article for you guys. Okay. A hidden message article. That's what Spirit's telling me to do. Pull a hidden message oracle for my Scorpios. Because y'all can be a little quiet. Y'all can be a little quiet. Not sneaky. I didn't say sneaky. See? Y'all was already taking offense. <laughs> didn't say that. I just said look quiet. That's it. I'm not the person. We ain't trying to get all up in your business, just some of your business, okay? <laughs> Descended Masters, Spirit, Universe, give me a message for my Scorpio babies. Please give me a message for my Scorpio babies. Well, that spoke quickly, didn't it? I know that I crossed the line with you. You probably did. I know I was a distraction for your pain. You probably was. You probably was in a way. I love you. Hmm. I wish I could take the words back. Okay. I lost myself a little for a little while. Hmm. So that would explain it, Scorpio. Either you or somebody in your energy. Okay. Flip it, switch it, get in where you fit in. There's no gender in terror. Tristan, go. Okay, hold on. I told y'all I was recording. Hold on. Let me pull some tarot. Get your cards. Okay. Okay. It is definitely talking. Okay. Let's see what came out first. You have the moon secrets. What did I tell y'all? Y'all always keeping secrets. Spirit's about to shine light on it though. Y'all are always keep, and it's not like y'all secret if y'all just don't say much. Okay. It's about your past relationship with the four cups. You and your feelings with the death card and the ten of pentacles. I mean the ten of cups. Okay. With the Seven of Cups, with the Three of Wands, with the Page of Pentacles, with the Ace of Wands, and the Nine of Pentacles. Okay. So basically, you know, you kept a secret of how you really felt about your past. The Spirit is shining light on the situation. Even though it's dead, there will not be a happy family life because you walked away from it, Scorpio, period. You didn't work it out. You didn't try to figure things out, nothing. You just walked away. I guess you just walked away from it because you want success. But now you're trying to come with that page of pinnacle offer because you want to hit her with the mirror or give up something. But you've been working on yourself, though. And that's a good thing. You know, you've been working on yourself. But now your sexuality has kicked in, you know. you horny as fuck. So now you're trying to do something. Tristan, get out of there. Get out of there. Now you're trying to do something. You know what I'm saying? But... You need a better way to do something, but do something besides your horny. You got to reverse that energy, Scorpio. You know, get creative, make a cake, go work out, do something. Okay? Do something besides humping. Okay? Because you are the star with the Aquarius energy. You are successful. You are creative. But due to this heartbreak, you probably don't feel that way. Okay? And that happens. And you've already called judgment on the situation. Makes, makes me think that you've already made a decision. You know what I'm saying? What else, Spirit? Because you have choices, okay? And you know that. 
And with the devil in reverse, you're not really thinking anything bad. You're not making those choices to be anything lustful. You know, you're just a little honey. You know what I'm saying? You ain't doing no drugs, alcohol, or anything like that. You ain't hanging around with the wrong people. You're keeping the steady crowd. But, you know, your love affair has went to splitteries, okay? But spirits are asking you to celebrate and start manifesting on the things you do want, okay? Forget about the things you don't want. And I know at the end of the night when your dick get hard, you're supposed to get wet or whatever, you starting to think about it, and it happens to everybody. Get a vibrator, watch some porn, jack off, get some grease. I don't know. But find you something else to do. And work on your career, obviously. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Put all that sexual frustration into your career with the Queen of Pentacles. Because that's where you're going to be looked at, okay? You're going to catch somebody. You're going to catch somebody. You're going to catch somebody. And it's going to balance all out there. And that's my message for you, loves. Bye.